bottom, ba, 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 the kitchen sink, the kitchen sink, you can't do better than the kitchen sink, if the crockery smells and you can't breathe things, throw it all into the kitchen sink, ba, um, ba, 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 um, ba, 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 the kitchen sink, the kitchen sink, you can't do better than the kitchen sink, your suitcase may be smaller than you think, pack everything except the kitchen sink, ba, um, ba, 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 um, ba, 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 the kitchen sink, the kitchen sink, you can't do better than the kitchen sink. If the toilet's locked, let me tip you the wink. Relieve yourself into the kitchen sink. Boom, ba, 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 boom, ba, 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 boom, ba, 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 boom, ba, 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 the kitchen sink. My uncle's dead. <laughs> that sport the mood, didn't it? <laughs> he died last week. My mum rang me up today, and apparently he is still dead. And he was an inventor. Look at you, looking at me. What a pity you couldn't afford me. He's an inventor. Look how flexible I am. He's an inventor. Stop it. He invented the strongest wig glue in the world. Strongest. But years ago, sir, sir, I don't know why I'm looking at you, sir. But years ago, can you not keep moving your head because the light reflects? I can't see a thing. It's not your fault. Oh, I feel terrible now. Can't believe I said that. Sorry, mate, I was only being serious. He invented... He, um, oh, it's spreading. He invented <laughs> the strongest wig glue in the world. They did a test. This is what they did. They glued a wig to a man's head using my uncle's wig glue. Did they? Yeah, and... <laughs> They took him up in a jumbo jet, this man with the wig on, with my uncle's wig glue. 500 miles an hour, jumbo jet. The man had to stick his head out the window. Flipping hack. <laughs> but it was a success, you know, because when they found the head, the wig was still on it. Hello? When? I'm doing the film. What, tomorrow? No, that's all right. No, that's no problem. Tomorrow, tomorrow at four o'clock. That's all right then. No, it don't worry. It's no, it's no problem. Of course I will. No problem. Of course I will. But no problem. It's no problem at all. Bye. It's going to be awkward, isn't it? I'm not going to do that. Go on. Tomorrow at four o'clock. I can't do that. No. I got... Oh my God. Do! I can't. I promise. I can't. No, I can't do it. I can't. It touched. It's put. I don't. I'll sort it out. Can I ask you your favourite comedian? <laughs> what sort of day have you had? <laughs> Interviewing on the streets is getting very tough. <laughs> Just a word before you go. Uh, can you tell me what your favourite aperitif would be? Is, it, is there anything that you wouldn't eat? <laughs> Obviously you're weight conscious. What would be, what would be your favourite form of diet? I'm a fridge magnet kind of guy. I just buy them and stick them on my fridge.
Anyway. <laughs> Look at you laughing. You don't know why. So, ladies and gentlemen, we had a party for my great aunt Mary. It was a lovely party, 67. She was, there was a lot of people, they were quite elderly, but I think that's fine. You can learn a lot from people of experience. I'll have a lot more to give, I'm sure, when I reach 30. <laughs> so, my, so, there was a lady there. Please watch me, don't miss any of this. There was a lady there, and she was quite elderly, to be honest with you. She was knocking on a bit. But she was all dressed up, she'd made the effort. And I said to my gran, who'd organised the party, who's that lady? She's dressed up for Great Aunt Mary. She said, don't talk to her, Andrew. I said, but she's made an effort. She said, please, don't talk to her. Her name is Lucy. And she's a nymphanesiac. I said, I don't think that's the right word, Gran. I said, it's not a very nice word, but I think the word you're looking for is nymphomaniac. She said, no, she's a nymphonesiac. She is sex mad, but she's forgotten why. <laughs> and I... I'll do this while you clap. You see, I don't think you should leave people out. And I went up to her, I said, hello, Lucy. Are you having a lovely time at Great Aunt Mary's party? This is what she did. She held her hand out like this. She said, if you can guess what's in my hand, you can make love to me. I felt terrible. <laughs> I didn't want to let her down. I didn't want to upset her. Standing like that. I said, is it a fully grown African elephant? She said, that's close enough. Well, then... It's a long way to Tipperary. It's a long way to go. It's a long way to Tipperary. To the sweetest girl I know called Blimey. Goodbye, Piccadilly. Farewell, Leicester Square. How are you doing? It's a long, long way to Tipperary, but my heart right there. Join in. It's a long way to Tipperary. It's a long way to go. It's a long way to Tipperary. Check it out. I'm the sweetest girl I know. Cold Limey. Good. Bye, Piccadilly, just sing that lady. Farewell, Leicester Square. It's a long, long way to Tipperary. But my heart, right there, I love you. Pack up the troubles in your road. Get back and stop this scene.